Welcome to the Laser Channel. I'm your host, Greg, and in this box, I'll be taking a look at the Atomstack R3 Pro Rotary Roller. It's their most current, up-to-date roller attachment for a laser machine. Stay tuned as I spend five minutes or less unboxing and taking an initial look at this rotary unit. Adam Stack was kind enough to send me this R3 Pro rotary roller to unbox and share with you viewers. The box arrived undamaged and it's a box inside of a box, so the actual component box was shipped inside, further protecting it. I do like it when manufacturers ship their product inside of another box that has packaging material in it. It's a great way to make sure that their product arrives to you safely. As I open this package, I see that there's this nice protective black foam. Any packages that I've received that had this nice uh, foam packaging material, I have not had any components or parts that have been damaged. Next, I run across the nice high quality manual that comes with the rotary. It goes through how to set it up, how to position it into your tool bed, along with an extensive uh, area on how to configure laser gerbil to work with this unit. It also includes a short section on light burn on connecting this to that software. That section is short because it's very quick and easy to connect and configure rotary units to light burn. First package that I remove out has these little stilts that come with it. I'll cover those in just a second. And again, everything is packaged in this nice form-fitted black foam. Next component is a set of cables. Each cable is color-coded black or white, making it very easy to know what cable you need for the next time you use the unit. Again, this takes just a minute to pull out of the box because everything is form-fitted. And this is the rotary unit. This is much larger than I thought it would be, and it does have some weight to it. Next component out of this box is this fully adjustable uh, bracket that goes, that can slide underneath the end for any irregular shaped glasses like pint glasses or stemware. This end piece is also adjustable for height and the rollers can move outwards and inwards, and they can also move up to get even closer yet for that fine stemware. And the last components in the package are the stilts that attach to uh, the A20 Pro, the X20 Pro, and the S20 Pro, along with any of the other Atom Stack uh, machines that have the, the foot that has a little hole in the side. There's a knob here that turns through that hole to securely attach this foot to the laser machine. That's all the components out of this box. One of the attentions to detail that I like about this kit is all the components that touch a tabletop surface have this non-stick pad on the bottom. And my tabletop is very slick, but none of these components move. With just light pressure down on the component, none of these move around. And I was particularly concerned anytime I raise the laser machine up, any stilts or legs that go, I want to make sure that these are rock solid and all of these pedestal stands are rock solid. And this stand does include several guidelines to help alignment when it is placed partially under the rotary attachment. These stands can be placed to either side of the rotary attachment and if I've got my prop right here, if you have a laser machine that has a smaller work bed area and you want a larger piece of work to process underneath your laser, you can use this rotary attachment and actually shuttle your work back and forth. And these outrigger stands have a nice roller bearing across the top to glide your work across for smooth and consistent operation. A couple of the key features that really drew me towards this rotary attachment is how easily these knobs are adjusted to 
adjust for the width of the rollers for different size works. Most of the time I'm turning glass stemware or pint glasses, but every once in a while I turn something that's significantly smaller or much, much larger. And it's nice to have this feature available. The other thing that I really like about this unit is this included roller stand for both types of glasses here. For the pint glass, when this is placed on, I can level this top surface so that it is parallel with the laser. So as I'm engraving the design into the glass, it's in perfect focus all the time. And this is just a system that works really, really well. And here's the last thing I wanted to show is the machine up on the stilts included with the kit with the rotary attachment in the center with plenty of clearance for all of your projects underneath. I hope you enjoyed this short video. Please leave a like, subscribe, or a comment down below. Until next time, have fun, be safe, and most of all, be creative.